Welcome to Imagination Station's Stay at Home Science. Today, we're sending secret messages with cipher wheels. A cipher wheel is a tool used to encrypt a message. To encrypt a message means to scramble it or make it unreadable to anyone who doesn't know how to decrypt it. Let's get started. To make your own cipher wheel, you'll first need to download and print out the cipher wheel template. Any paper will work, but cardstock works best. You'll also need scissors and a brass fastener. Carefully cut around the outer edge of each disc. Place the smaller disc on top of the larger disc and press the brass fastener through the X, securing loosely in the back. Notice that each disc has the alphabet, but in opposite directions. To use the cipher wheel to send a message, we first need to choose a key to encrypt and decrypt the message. Pick one letter from the smaller disk and line it up with a different letter on the larger disk. I'm choosing I and S for imagination station. Next, write out the message you would like to encrypt. Without spinning the disks of your cipher wheel, locate the first letter of your message on the larger disk and write down the letter that appears underneath it on the smaller disk. Continue one letter at a time until your entire message has been encrypted. Now, now you have a message that is unreadable unless someone has the key and a cipher wheel to decrypt it. Send only the encrypted message to your friend and be sure to find a separate way to share the key with them as well. Hey, I have another message for you. Can you decrypt this? Encryption isn't just useful for sending messages to our friends. We use encryption every day to protect the information that we send, receive, and store online. Of course, we don't use a cipher wheel to protect that kind of information. Instead, more advanced encryption involves computer algorithms, which are sets of processes and rules that create unique encryption and decryption keys. Be sure to share a photo of your cipher wheel and any secret messages you create to Imagination Station's Facebook page. If you liked this activity and are interested in more stay-at-home science, be sure to visit imaginationstationtoledo.org.